Hello, my name is Amy Steele. I'm originally from Oma in Northern Ireland. I came to Cardiff in 2007 to study a five-year integrated master's programme in civil engineering, which I've now just graduated from with a first-class honours. My degree incorporated a year in industry, which I spent within the public sector at Caffili County Borough Council's Highways, Infrastructure and Projects Group. This offered me an exposure to a wide range of engineering experiences, including the responsibility for the design and supervision of a number of schemes, taking them from conception to completion within the various sectors of civil engineering. This helped me significantly when I came back to university and when applying for graduate jobs, as I was more aware of what I wanted for my future career and the experience that I had gained differentiated me from other candidates. It was also nice to take a break from studying and to put into practice some of the stuff that I'd already learnt at university and the best bit was definitely earning a wage which I thoroughly enjoyed spending every single penny off. One of the highlights of my time at Cardiff was successfully securing a place on the prestigious China Engineering Education Excellence Alliance of 2011 summer camp. This was a month-long sponsored educational tour of three top Chinese universities in Shanghai, Chongqing and Xi'an which included engineering cultural lectures as well as some sightseeing trips to China's top visitor attractions, so it really was the experience of a lifetime. As for my current situation, I have secured employment as a graduate highways engineer within OVAR at the Cardiff Bay branch, where I will begin employment on the 6th of September. Finally, I am really pleased I chose Cardiff. It's a brilliant up and coming city, so you'll never be stuck for something to do or see. As for the university, it's one of the top in the UK, so you can be assured you're being taught by someone who definitely knows their stuff and is at the forefront of their field, and from my experience, will support you through your studies. Even better still in some people's eyes is Cardiff Students Union, which has to be one of the best in the country with its regular club nights, athletics union and student support services. My five years at Cardiff have been amazing. It's been everything I wanted and more from the university. So if I did have to do the whole student thing again, I'd 100% pick Cardiff every single time. Hey, uh, my name is Nikki Stockbridge and I study architectural engineering at Cardiff University graduating in 2004. I grew up in a farm in Shropshire and attended an all-girls school. Although my strongest sub subjects were maths and physics, engineering was not suggested as a career choice for me um, as my school careers advisor did not think that it was a, a subject that girls could do. However, one of my teachers thankfully saw the potential and suggested that I took a place on an Insight into Engineering course being held at Cardiff University. Here I got to try out a variety of different types of engineering from mechanical and electrical to civil and water. And two choices were made during this time. Firstly, that I wanted to be an engineer and secondly, that I wanted to study in Cardiff. When I applied to Cardiff, I chose to do a year in industry. Although I was worried about being left behind by my classmates, the potential of earning money and gaining valuable experience was a much bigger draw. Thanks to my lecturers, I managed to get a place at Ar Arab in Cardiff. Here, not only did I earn some much needed money, but I also gained great experience into designing with a number of materials attending meetings and working in a team. The best part of my year in industry was that I was offered a sponsorship of my final two years of university and was also offered a job at the end of it so long as I got a decent degree. In addition, the contacts I made and the confidence I gained during my year in industry really helped me finish my last two years of university. And as I mentioned, as I was already offered a job, I didn't have to go looking for work in my final year and could con concentrate entirely on my studies. As I did manage to get a good degree, I went on to work at Arup after graduation and I still work there eight years on. I'm now a senior engineer running my own projects and managing a team of younger engineers. When I first started back at Arup following my graduation, I actually worked on a project that I'd been working on the previous summer. As such, I was familiar with the work, the people I was working with, 
and the computer programs used I was using and I was given quite a large amount of responsibility quite early on. From, there, from then on I've gone from strength to strength. I've worked on hospitals, stadia, high-rise residential, schools and museums. Along the way in 2009 I became chartered both with the Institution of Structural Engineers and the Institution of Civil Engineers. Since then, I've also taken up a visiting lecturing post at another nearby university and have become chairperson for a local charity that construct buildings in sub-Saharan Africa called Engineers for Overseas Development. If I were to do my studies again, I would definitely choose Cardiff University. This is for a number of reasons. Not only is the standard of teaching top quality, but the lecturers are really friendly and approachable and in fact I'm in contact with many of them today. I had a wonderful time both studying and socialising in Cardiff as the Welsh capital has a great deal to offer and as for the engineering course the field trips were pretty awesome too.